All right, I'm going to show you how to go to the next. Uh, your, you open your game, and what we're going to do is create a new level. And so what you do is you go File, New Level, and you, it's really important that you select this one because it has all the uh, settings that you need, basically. So just click on that, and it will uh, include the lighting, etc. And, you know, you can scroll out. One thing that's really important is if this is on 3, put it on 4. It just moves a little bit quicker, and that's... When you start getting the uh, fine details and stuff, if you want to... Uh, Wrote it back to three, it'll be okay. So um, now the th first thing I do is I usually delete this and I usually just hit the delete key. And if it, that doesn't work, just go edit and delete. Okay. So now I'm ready to uh, start uh, creating. So what I want to show you here is there's this uh, this is your brush panel and this is your uh, basically terrain panel. So there's quite a few things in here. Uh, but for the most part, the thing we care the most about is you're probably, your settings probably 63 by 63. So that's the size of this level. And it's going to make, as you can see, a pretty big level. So we're going to go 31 by 31. And for the most part, don't play around with any of these other settings. Okay, just leave them that way. And then you click create. So right now I'm in the manage mode. When you click on that, you'll see this appear. And one the thing that I find that is easy is I like to zoom out so that I can see everything from the top. So you can obviously move around with your W, S, D key. Okay, so you see I'm moving forward. But I really like using the E key to uh, zoom outwards. So I'm going to do that right now. The E and I have the right mouse button pressed. And what happens is, and then I'm going to press the Alt key and, and the left mouse button. Oops, let me just get that. The brush is already on. Second here. Just press the all button and rotate it so that I. And you want to be all the way out here. Now the, your bracket tool uh, does work often to shrink the size of your brush. So I'm going to go. I want a brush about this size. And usually the strength that I use is I'll go with 0.35. Okay, so that should probably be good enough. And I can also change the brush fall off, but for and the brush that's pretty good. I'm gonna and basically what I want you to do is create your mountain range. And the goal of this is that your character does not fall off. Okay. And so there's a bunch of other tools in here that I'm gonna show you in a second. So I'll just pause the video here and, oops. Okay, and that, here's what I'm gonna do now. I've got it done. I'm gonna press shift and the same brush tool and instead make a small lake. So I don't make it too big of a lake here. So there you go, that's about it and that's my lake. Now I, I just wanna show you something else that's kind of handy. So I'm gonna make a little mountain over here. So I'm gonna go like, like this. And that's gonna be where I'm gonna put my castle. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go and get the uh, a different tool. Oh, it's actually over here, and I want the flatten tool. So this tool is really handy. Student council members, are so basically with this flatten tool, I just flatten this whole level so that I can put my castle on it, and it'll make it like perfectly flattened. Now there's a couple other really cool t tools in here that make your your whole thing look nicer. So this is kind of makes it erosion, which is now it's probably too strong, so I'm going to go back here and I'm going to reduce the strength to, I'll say like 0.6 or something. So, you know, it'll just make it look like there's a little bit of roughness like uh, on it. And maybe even 0.6 is a little too much here. I notice it might be a little too much, so I'll lower it even more to like 0 0.1 or something. So basically adds erosion, but not like too much. And if I zoom in, I'll be able to see like little, uh, you know, you know, it looks like wind or whatever damaged it over time. There's a couple other tools in here, uh, noise. So I'll repeat that. You have to go. You're probably in mountain mode, so landscape mode. Just click over here, and then click on your player start, and press F. So this will zoom you in. And one thing that I do is use the Alt key to make sure. Now probably it's going to be like that. If it's like that, you need to move it out. All right. And then when you press play, or press play, 
So there he doesn't fall through. Now you can run around and see what your level looks like. Okay, if you have any questions, please let me know.